heavy rains overnight into today, pushing up water levels and threatening more flooding here in northeast Wisconsin. Thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson. And I'm Nina Sperano. NBC 26's Ryan Curry is on Green Bay's east side tonight, talking with residents about the threat and how they're preparing for potential evacuation. On the east side of Green Bay, residents are still reminiscing about the flooding that took place back in March that forced many of them to evacuate. And now with the threat of flooding once again coming to this area this week, many residents say they feel a little more prepared about what to do this time as they did back in March. The Green Bay Fire Department sent out a notice to residents advising people about the potential for flooding Wednesday night into Thursday. Now back in March, the East River flooded onto city streets, forcing many to evacuate. And now with the threat of more flooding once again coming to this area, residents who I spoke with say they feel a little bit better about how the things could go. They say the flooding back in March helped them prepare in case they have to evacuate once again. Making sure our sump pump works. Um, we have a generator if we need extra power. Um, but a lot of it's making sure our sump pump is working and getting our expensive stuff out of um, the flood area. Now Green Bay Fire suggested residents stay informed with local weather reports and also avoid electrical outlets if they see water creep into a home, especially onto electrical equipment. And also they advise residents to stay away from standing water. There's no telling how deep it could actually be. Reporting on the east side of Green Bay, Ryan Curry, NBC 26.